Good morning, you incredible habitants of Farmington High School. Today is Friday, November 15th, and you're watching The Early Bird. I'm Mariah Lockwood. And I'm Sean Jackson. Today for lunch, we'll be enjoying cheeseburgers or hot dogs. Your photos are needed for the yearbook. Summer photos are especially needed. You can upload photos using the website and password shown below. Camp War Eagle applications are now available for sophomores and juniors. Make sure to enroll by December 15th. Yoga meets today in Ms. Fusen's room during both lunches. There will be a holiday whodunit on Tuesday, December 10th from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. This is a murder mystery party, so make plans to be there. More information will be announced soon. Project Graduation sponsors the Holiday Bazaar, which is happening tomorrow. Help is needed to set up today, and also help is needed with the actual event tomorrow. You can sign up through the link on the screen. There will be a Holiday Bazaar tomorrow from 9 in the morning to 2 in the afternoon at Farmington Junior High School. Admission is $2, but for anyone of 10 years or younger, it will be free. Activities include photos with Santa, refreshments, holiday music, and a plethora of shopping opportunities. Finally, here's a quote to think about. Without a struggle, there can be no progress. Frederick Douglass. Thank you, Farmington. Now it's time for the part you've all been waiting anxiously for. Farmington Week in Weather with the most epic meteorologist you know, Reed Petrie. Yes. Thank you all. I'm Farmington's weatherman, Reed Petrie, and here is your weekend weather. First, this past week has been cold. I noticed Tuesday morning made it down to 12 degrees as we made it to school. That sleet and that bit of snow on Monday that caused us to get out of school early was very welcomed. It has been a winter wonderland this week, even though winter doesn't actually start for another 36 days. Anyway, here's your outlook for the week. As you can see, this weekend should be pretty uniform on all three days. The highs will be a bit above 50 degrees, and the lows will be oscillating around 30 degrees. There's not really a chance of rain all weekend. It should be sunny on Friday and Saturday, but it'll get cloudier on Sunday. There wasn't much to report this week since we'll have a very homogenous weekend weather-wise. Josh Cartwright has returned for another edition of Card Center. Take it away, Josh. Thank you, Reed, and indeed, I'm Josh Cartwright, and welcome to another segment of Card Center. To kick things off in the warm indoors, your Lady Cards now have two wins under their belt, participating in the Westford Tournament, winning both games pretty handily. They finish off the tournament with the final game tomorrow night. Stop by the Cardinal Arena and watch the Lady Cards in action at home, as well as seeing the male Cardinals begin their season. Providence Academy is tonight's opponent. If you can't make it, tune into Farm Cards Live and watch it from the comfort of your couch. Next, your Cardinal cross-country team participated in the state meet to finish fifth out of 25 teams. This year, they are conference runners-up behind Huntsville. However, Mason Gons finished first for our team, grabbing a personal record with the time of 1835. Mason is only a sophomore, and we wish him luck and are excited about what he can do these next few years. This year's cross-country team has the best times seen in Farmington, including Colby Gardner finishing first in all of his races this season, with the exception of state finals where the health issues came into play. As far as the ladies' cross-country team, they finished ninth with Joel Tidwell breaking the school record with the time of 22.08. Thank you to all these seniors for your hard work and dedication. Cannon King, Colby Gardner, Joel Tidwell, Addie Castle, Scarlett Turner, and Katie Jansen. Lastly, your Farmington Cardinal football team ended their season at the Harrison Goblin Stadium with the tough loss of 49-20. Good luck with off-season preparation. Thank you, Cardinals, and looking at these results, we have a bright future ahead of us in our sports program. Go Cardinals. Right now, I just need you to get real loose. Get comfortable. Grab your loved ones, or grab your love partner. And if you're by yourself, no worries. Just follow after me. Yeah. Gonna do the two-step. Cowboy boogie. Grab a sweetheart and spin out with him. Do the hold down and get into it. Take it to the left now and dip with it. Gonna throw down, take a sip with it. Now lean back, put your hips in it. Let's have some fun. Uh. To the left, to the left now. To the right, to the right. Now take your left hand and put it on your side. Gonna roll your shoulders, do the slip and slide. This next part's my favorite part, uh, cause it's time to shine. Gonna do the two step and cowboy boogie. Grab a sweetheart and spin out with him. Do the hold down and get into it. Take it to the left now and dip with it. Gonna throw down, take a sip with it. Now lean back, put your head, sit it. It's simple, you can do it. 
Slide to the left, slide to the right. Now cool down. Have a good time. Slide to the left, slide to the right. Do the butterfly. Have a good time round, round, round around you go. It's time to show out right now and take to the floor. Gonna do the two step and cowboy boogie. Grab a sweetheart. Challenge Coach Scribner, Coach Harper, and the boys' baseball team. Go Cards. 